it is this. We're going to be using the Karen Diash Water Soluble Neo Color Wax Pastels today. Let's go. So this is a pack of four. They're all the same color and they are samples. I think these were, um, I got these absolute years ago. So we're going to be needing a pot of water and a paintbrush. And this is a little rooster, bird, chicken, whatever you call it. I pre-sketched off camera. On my channel, you will see a no reference version of this chicken. Whereas this one was done with reference. So, Karen Diash Neo Art is a water soluble wax pastel and they come in different colours. They are very expensive. Um, these samples, um, I can't remember how I got hold of them. They could have been sent to me absolute years ago. Um, but, you know, whatever, we have them now. Um, you can, like with any of the other water-soluble ones, draw with it directly, like that. Take a damp paintbrush and just wipe your brush over the colour. Or you can apply your brush directly to the pastel and pick up your colour like so, so that it's like a pan. I'm, I have to say, I'm not really that fussed. That's why I've still got them, I think. I'm not really that fussed on water-soluble wax uh, pastel crayon things because they tend, as you can see here, when you put the colour down like so, they tend to not break up fully and you're left with the texture of the crayon underneath. And this happens with every brand however expensive they are or however cheap they are. Um, I am using a watercolour paper. This is the Arteza sketchbook. But you can see here, the marks are left. Let's see if we get it. Let's see if we get marks from doing The colour directly. And no, we don't. So, basically you can use them like a, a pan. Just picking the colour up directly using your damp paintbrush. Now, Karen Diash are incredibly expensive. They uh, are known for very high quality. They are, of course, all light fast and they create luminous colours. So you are paying for high quality pigments and they are going to last you a very long time. The actual paints themselves, because very little is needed. I do have a set of um, Lyra Aqua Crayons and again um, they give me the same results. They too are light fast but they can clog your paintbrush because of them being a wax crayon. You can build up layers quite easily.
If you wet the paper first and then apply the, the uh, crayon, it's incredibly intense. If we do a little here, you can see the difference. But you won't then be able to add more water really to break up. So I hope you've liked your introduction to these Karen Diash Neo Art Water Soluble Pastels. And I'll catch you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>